action. We're back in the action, boys. Holy fucking moly, I just got hit with some news. It took me back a little bit, man. Like a rock hitting my cock. Now, once this rock hit my cock, it took me back a step. I didn't know what to expect. This was unlike any rock that has ever hit the tip of my cock. It was somewhat of a beautiful rock. A pebble, if you will. Now, if this isn't enough detail for you guys, let me go further. Once this pebble-sized rock hit above my dangleberries, my little shrimp, if you will, my shrimp gained in size. It became one of those big shrimps. And from there, I knew this news that I got, the news that replicated a rock hitting my cock, was good news. This news that I'm going to behold to you guys, I don't know how you're going to take it, but this news that I took is somewhat heavenly. The one they call Justin Bieber, yes, you heard that right, is now getting engaged to Haley Baldwin. <laughs> right now, neighbor, and why the fuck do you care? Bruh, y'all know Selena Gomez? <laughs> yeah, that bitch is mine now. Uh, hey, man, let me just start off by saying anything you guys ever want can be achieved. The amount of effort I have put into getting Selena Gomez and Justin Bieber apart is unimaginable. You know, it's all about waiting for the right purpose. Waiting for that right moment for it to strike the amount of times I've hit up Justin Bieber in his DMs. Tell him, hey, lay off of Selena Gomez some other shit that I don't need to tell y'all because it's none of your business. Hey, Beepster, <sighs> or whatever. Um, sorry, just hitting you up real quick because uh, Selena Gomez hasn't really been getting my texts recently on Instagram. Thought I'd hit you up because you're probably with her. Just wanted to show her what I'm packing. If you want to pass along the message, go for it. All right, boys, but show her how big we can get. Okay, come on, come on, boys. Show her how big we can get. Think of grandma's butt. Oh, there we go. Yeah, yeah. That was me. Oh, fuck. Unless you guys saw the black bar above that guy's penis and you thought it was a big enough black bar to cover up probably what is a giant penis, um, that wasn't me. Anyway, that's not my point. My point is, who the fuck keeps editing that? Someone's getting fired. <laughs> My real point is, boys, anything you ever want to get in life can be yours. Selena Gomez is now mine. My one competition is gone. Selena, I'ma treat you like a god. I'ma dangle my nuts in your mouth as long as you want it all day, every day. I will give you the world. And with that said, I hope that she watches this video and this really works out for me. Now let's get on to what this video is actually about. I'm pretty fucking soaked right now, boys. Leave comments down below. Celine Brand 2018, baby. It's lit. Thams, real, real strong. We're murking the game, the greatest of all time. The support's been unreal. Therefore, it's time for another merch giveaway. If y'all want to win another merch shirt by name brand, Easy Killer by name brand is what we call it. Leave a comment down below, something positive. Also, leave a thumbs up on this video. Hit the notification bell, that's the most important part, and subscribe. I will pick one of you guys to send a shirt of your size down below. And it's really sick when you wear it because, honestly, the more people Selena Gomez sees wearing those shirts and finally sees Easy Killer in the flesh she, she yeah, her flesh is gonna be wet <laughs> super inappropriate but it's, uh, it's, so, it's such a fantasy it's such a fantasy it is <laughs> Now with that said, let's get into the premise of the video. Now, I don't have his name. Leave a comment if this was you down below. I lost it in the fucking messages I just looked for. Somebody hit me up yesterday saying, Name brand, I found a really dope mystery box on eBay, and you should check it out. Now, countless times I get these fucking messages, and I usually tell you guys to fuck off. However, this one was quite cool. What this mystery box was from eBay is apparently, and I'm saying apparently because I don't know what's in here yet, but we got it, is apparently you're going to get a pair of Yeezys of any choice. This mystery box has any Yeezys, not of your choice, but of their choice, for retail. Now, I thought this was way too good to be true. I thought we had to try it out. I bought one day shipping on it. Like, I contacted the dude. I paid him, like, 50 extra bucks to get it to me today because I didn't have any other content for this video. And we got it here right now. So, without further ado, boys, the box that I behold, hopefully you didn't see that address because a lot of y'all love to send dilts. <laughs> it's crazy. I hate it. Uh, beholds, apparently, what is a pair of Yeezys for retail. And if you guys look at the box, I'm actually quite peeved at this. It's got no question mark like the picture shows on the ad. So for that, off with his head! <laughs> Something didn't feel good there. The tip of my nose hurts after that. Alright boys, after a lot of struggles, <laughs> we got the box over right now though. This is how I see it. It's got a Yeezy box. I'm gonna do a lot of legit checks on these. I don't 
think they're gonna be fake because eBay's pretty secure on that. Like, he's gonna get fucked if they're fake. However, boys, oh, will you guys leave a guess down below what they're gonna be? I hope they're. Oh, man, what do I want? Dude, if they were in blue tint easy as V2s, I would be in a fucking fuck. I spilled my beer when I dropped that. It's okay, I got many more. All right, so <laughs> anyway, I hope they're blue tint easy V2s. I destroyed my other ones. That's the main easy that I love to wear. It's the only easy I've actually worn before because I destroy everyone for y'all's entertainment. Without further ado, we got a. Uh, 200? Oh! <laughs> oh, it's a 500! Sorry, I saw it backwards. I'm like, this is fucking fake. Okay, what? First up, <laughs> holy shit, okay. So if these are real, and if we, if we if we see that they're real, I'll put a link down below. I've never actually gotten a mystery box like this from eBay. Here's the main check, actually, with, uh, with legit boxes. I don't like that. Usually they fart. Okay, fuck! Get it together. Ah, oh, shit. That hurt a little bit. Ouch. Actually, quite a bit. The power of my hand is fierce. Anyway, let's get... <laughs> oh, my God. I've never owned a pair of 500s. I'm going to say that right now. I've actually... I've never even held them in hand, I don't think. I've seen people wearing them. Oh! Are these the ones that came out yesterday? Or the day before? What day is it? It's Saturday, Friday? Monday today? I don't know when these came out. Oh, these are the newest ones. Holy shit. What's the resale on these right now? Anyway, boys, as y'all can see, I need y'all to do legit checks right now. We have a fucking Yeezy 500, the black ones, which is crazy. Holy shit. Hold on, I'm just gonna check really quick how much these go for so I can give you guys a little update on how much money we got from this bitch. StockX, of course. All right, here we go. Okay, so it's not even on the page of most popular. That's a little frightening, actually. Okay, sneakers. They're going for $249. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck! $249? I spent like three... After shipping, I spent like 400 Canadian on, on this. What the fuck? Are these not hyped? These are really dope. Anyway, this is what we got in the mid. Sorry, I'm just kind of thinking to myself right now. Did I get fucked? Did I literally just get fucked? It says outlet in them! Oh, no, it doesn't. Okay, sorry. I was like, what the fuck? Is it supposed to say that? Ortholite? That seems fucking fucky. Anyway, we got these. I expected to get like a Yeezy V2 or something. That does seem too good to be true. I guess we got, I guess we got the newest ones. I'm pretty sure these are the ones that just dropped. But you guys let me know what you think. I want to look at the other one, actually. Honestly, I ain't like that pissed. I think I oh, way overspent. It was like 450 Canadian after all the shipping and extra that I had to pay. It seems like, and I'm not, I'm not, I'm not downing this guy right now, you fucking piece of shit. But it seems like... He probably just had a lot of overstock on these if they're going for that low. And he just sent me some fucking overstocked Yeezys for a lot more than I probably needed to pay if they're that much on StockX. And anyway, needless to say, I'm actually kind of stoked because I've been wanting a pair of these for a little bit now for some customs, maybe a soul swap, something like that. You guys let me know if I should be wearing these sneakers, what kind of custom you guys might want to see with them. Also, if they are real or fake. If these ones just dropped and I'm, if I'm correct on that, on that, I don't think they have like a lot of fakes on them yet. They they look pretty good. Once again, I've never held them in hand. They kind of collapse a little bit here. It looks like a fucking ball sack pouch right there. Wow, cradle my nuts for me. Oh man, just bringing it back to Selena. I will cradle my nuts on your face anytime you want. Anyway, that's the shoes we got from this fucking mystery box. If you guys want a link down below, I may provide it. Um, and I kind of want to see what you guys get if you do decide to buy this if he's just giving these away Or if he's giving some other hype shit away, but that's it. I'm kind of stoked These are honestly a little bit cooler than I thought they would be in hand and I kind of want to try them on So once again, we'll leave this video at this. Should we fuck them up? Should we soul swap the bitches? Or should we wear them for once? Because these things look like a fucking tactical shoe I feel like I'd be in, I feel like I'd be an iRobot wearing these or maybe like a sick porno of like Star Wars or something just like crip walking around with my big long shaft that looks like a lightsaber but it's my dick and I'm in porn and Selena Gomez plays Princess Amidala that'd be sick that's what I feel like I'll probably have to wear these now anyway y'all let me know what you think about this as y'all can see, I'm also trying to uh, keep going with time. Keep going with time so we can get this to 10 minutes. Yes. More ad revenue, more shit for you to watch. Even though I said cock and balls a few times in this video, more than I probably should have, which means demonetized stat. This is them. And it's a good thing I can keep talking about shit that doesn't even matter and somehow is still entertaining apparently because hey, you get a retard in front of the camera and everyone wants to watch. I should be upset about that. Guess what? I'm not because I just... You got to accept in life what you have. And what I have is a gift from God telling me that I'm a fucking idiot 
and I probably shouldn't still be here. However, he put me on YouTube for, I don't even believe in the dude. I shouldn't probably be saying that either. I've had a couple beers, boys, and uh, you know, full send always. So that's the kicks. These are kind of cool. First mystery box, first legit jit mystery box I think I've done off eBay that kind of had sneakers in it. I've done some other ones before with like with like accessories, but I've never done a sneaker one, so I'm quite stoked for it. And that's what we got. Appreciate y'all for watching, Name Brad Thams. Real, real strong. We're murking the game, the greatest of all time. Shit! The box fell again. Ugh, I should have known that that box is not stable there. Okay, I'm out. Peace. Blow.